You had a famous feud with uh, Ravishing Rick Rude. Yeah. Um, you want to tell us about that? Well, I came out of rehab, and uh, they thought it was a good idea, maybe to have my wife travel with me, to get me back on my feet and get me back to used to being on the road. And, um, you know, it wasn't a good idea. Because, uh, number one, my wife did not want to be on the road. Number two, she did not want to be in front of a camera. And number three, guys, if you want to save your marriage, don't take your wife on the road. Because, um, unfortunately, your wife sees too much. And when I say that, she'll see other wrestlers uh, being inappropriate with girls and stuff. And uh, here's your wife. It's friends with half of them. And these assholes don't give a fuck, man. They expect me to, you know, hold my finger up and tell her to shh. And by me doing that, which I did, you know, hey, don't get involved in that. That's her shit. Don't you say nothing to them. Well, what did that wife think of me? You know, it caused a lot of problems, a lot of problems. And um, um, one funny thing that happened was uh, Rick Rude, uh, she slapped Rick Rude one time, and uh, Rick Rude told me afterwards, your wife hits harder than you do. And she busted his eardrum. <laughs> Is it true that he was fairly intense in the ring? Oh, yeah. Yeah, he was wound pretty tight. Rick was dangerous. Is that why Hogan never wrestled yeah. him? Yeah, I'm sure. Well, that, and he knocked out Dizzy a couple of times, <laughs> which was pretty funny. <laughs> and... Uh... Honky Talk Man actually told us a story about Rick Rude's death, that it was actually suicide due to him injecting Viagra directly into his... Well, that's what I heard too, but I don't know. But yeah, I'll let God sort that out, man. Regardless, you know, him and Perfect and all those guys that are gone, man. You know, you can say it's suicide, you can say it's an accident, you can say this, I'll say this, they're dead. And uh, it's a damn shame. And you just mentioned Dizzy Hogan, of course, Brutus the Barber Beefcake. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure if you wrestled, I'm sure you probably did here and there, but what did you think of him as a personality? I don't even want to go there, man. I'll leave that alone.